how to be strong in this world where you are being judged all the time who wants to be strong first we should know when you say that how to be strong in this world where you are being judged all the time who is the one who is asking who is the questioner because unless you are aware of yourself you cannot be strong all the time who is judging you who is feeling somewhere weak or nervous because once you understand the theory of this i and you automatically you will understand no one in this world is strong or weak all are in the same all are in the same no body is upper or lower no body is superior or inferior no body is strong or weak because we all are coming from the one because this question if you want the answer or solution for this to be strong in this world where you have been judged all the time by others you should go back to the basics of your being definitely this answer will come from the inner inner life from where your outside this body is operating so the inner knowledge of the life conscious soul what we say is spirituality you may not sometimes be religious because everyone in this world is not religious especially you see our young children in the world are not so religious they hardly think of going to temples gurdwaras mosques churches so religious is outside activities of the god all that connected with the outside world so being religious is not compulsory you are liberal you are free you choose yourself to go to temple gurdwara mosque or church and no one compels you there is no rule for it have ever you seen any rule in any of the city or country that everyone will go to the temple or the mosque or the church or the gurdwara or any of the temple jain temple both temple or whatever in the world so many religions not compulsory or you are not accepting any god not the problem you accept or not hindu says our god is krishna rama we are not forced that you accept guru nanak dev muhammad allah Jesus someone is accepting Jesus as the god son 
but they are not posed you accept the krishna or rama or sai baba likewise no religion in the world is forcing the other one you accept neither in the society nor in the city nowhere even you see parents are saying to the children those who are religious so go for the temple go for the church mosque go for puja go for some thing connected with the god some fast some roza but all are not doing that so even parents wants children are not doing so i want to say you this is very very clear outside religion which connects you with the god the creator who had created you who is sustaining you and one day who will destroy you destroy death you may be the richest person of the world you may on the top chair of the world you may be the most beautiful personality of the world but death is going to kill you and when death comes you are just becoming beggar everything whatever you have here your big properties your big amount of money your biggest chair whatever whoever you are whatever personality the beautiful face everything will be snatched from you and you are just dying as a beggar empty hands so the one who is there to create you who is sustaining you today the same will destroy you one day so these all theory of your birth sustaining and the death this all belongs to the spirituality the god name whatever you say say it rama krishna buddha mahavira jesus guru nanak dev mohammed sahab allah meera bhai sahajo bhai lalla bhai laudju sukrati whatever name you want to add you add it but the important thing is the god knowledge and doing for the god is different doing is religion outside when you do something you pray you worship you go to temple or mosque or church or gurudwara you go for fast do it go for donation do it this all is a doing practices connected with the religion but where there is no doing is the knowledge of your being whether you accept it or not that some god your favorite god others are not your favorite you are bonded stick to your religion even you are hating other religions not the matter but inner knowledge of your being if you don't have the creator who had created you from the head hair to brain to eyes to mouth to nose to ears and the whole body and who is sustaining you by keeping the battery charged inside and if you don't understand that you are nothing right from the birth till now because death had not come the one had not come to destroy you to kill you death when we say he died because of heart attack died because of cancer died because of accident do you think heart or some 
part of the body or the car or the train or the plane is responsible for your death or someone else is there who is taking you to the death you say died because of accident died because of heart attack died because of kidney problem died because of brain problem or is there something else so these questions if you have in the mind you will be able to understand because my answer is to for these questions now your question of getting myself strong which is not becoming possible because the judgment from the others is coming and you are feeling somewhere inferiority disturbed like by looking the others she is so beautiful my face is not so beautiful he is having so big job i don't have so many girlfriends he had i don't have he is so intelligent getting so many marks but i am not getting it his parents are so much luxurious my parents are poor he lives in america i don't live there so these are many many comparison you have in your life that comparisons makes you weak that comparison makes you inferior and if you go to the state of your being where all have come with the dust birth all had come with the dust your body skin is made of dust inside your blood becoming from the water air going from the nose making your inside that gas what say burning gas inside burning what food you take in the stomach it is burning and brain part is the sky part so these five elements body let it be any one born on this earth any human being with these five elements only no one in the world will say i am the richest man so i have brought my mind from london no man will say i have brought my brain from america or i brought my this eyes from india no so all have got free of cost all parts of the body including the mind so it is the mind which you say is the brilliant if someone becomes a topper you say it is the mind if somebody sits on some big chair but i say to you all whatever is coming is not belonging to you not belonging to others all are born with the complete mercy from the one creator and because of that predestined with that what we say the desire and the bad karma or good karma in previous human birth you have come to this human birth today nothing in your body belongs to you nothing in the body of anyone in this world belongs to the him or her let it be the biggest president of the world any country prime minister let it be any biggest richest man of the world let it be the beauty most face of the face who had made your face beautiful if some was i am so beautiful who had made your face beautiful ha huh? let the age go your face will become ugly you see nowadays cosmetics round the world are maximum on sale but how long you will be beautiful inside you have complete sewerage from all parts of your body all exit gates of your body like two eyes two ears to nose mouth and your reproductive organs 
कंप्लीट फ्रॉम इनसाइड सीवरेज इज कमिंग स्मेल बेड स्मेल वॉट एवर कमिंग आउट सो वन डे वेन दैट एनर्जी दैट क्रिएटर पार्ट कम्स आउट यू विल बी जस्ट ए रॉटन लाइक सीवरेज इफ यू जस्ट लुक इन टू सम वन हु डाइड एंड आफ्टर वन डे टू डे somebody had gone and broken the door so much spell in that area complete rotten so beautiful faces you have seen many new jet come if no go to that if you think you are beautiful if you say i am very brain very intellectual go to that where all intelligent people of the world had gone to the graveyard or the cremation ground if you think i am the richest person Go to all those richest people, those that died, where they have gone to the cremation ground and the graveyards. Today you are, tomorrow you won't be. This is the fact. All those those who have taken birth here are going to die one day. So birth and death is the game. Birth and death is the game. So between these two. life is moving life is moving so you should understand when you feel inferior from anyone judgment from anyone comes just keep in mind the other one is going to die one day this is the temporary game you are also going to die many before you had come on this earth your forefather for 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 father for for father where they have gone where the name you know all we are from the same dust made from the same dust and we'll go to the dust so what the comparison because when you are feeling yourself somewhere disturbed by judgment of the people on anything personality business job country all are going to die the whole universe whole world population who one had taken birth today will also die next 100 years today 2023 you can say 2024 he will be no more after the 100 years why you are worried you understand or not nothing in the body let it be the richest person of the world again i am saying you let it be on the biggest chair of the world let it be the beautiful person of the world nothing in his body or her body belongs to the one and if someone showing his ego by judging you by judging you who judges he is a, if someone somebody comes and judges you shows you inferior you simply take it the bad karma is getting locked inside because only the one is there creator of all of us and you had just gone through that in the spirituality we know that they say god is one there is a ek hi allah there is one allah only there is only one in the sikhism say ek omkar satnam there is only one in the ancient epics spiritual epics of hinduism advait one no two so if we all are one from the one who is there to judge who is there to judge all are beggars one day all become beggars at death everything is snatched and at birth all came in the same way with the empty hand so it is only the journey from birth to death of the destiny which you asked in the previous birth desire i want to be minister i want to be officer i want to in india i want in america you got it plus your bad karma what is bad karma you are not happy in your life you are not in relax you asked for your this all relationships you asked for this all your post in your previous over what you got it now you are weeping disturbing you say someone is judging you 
अरे लैटियम जज द वन इज नॉट गिविंग यू फूड दैन वन इज नॉट गिविंग यू क्लोथ और शेल्टर एंड इवन सम वन इज गिविंग यू दिस वॉज ऑल प्री लोन्स इन द लास्ट बर्थ लास्ट बर्थ यू वुड है दैट लोन्स ही जस्ट गिविंग यू बैक एट डेथ ऑल विल गो विद द सेम मैच स्टिक सेम With the same match stick, all bodies will be cremated, and if going to the grave, all will go in the same touch, in the same, same tabud, same box. So, one thing is very clear: that the life is very short, which you take as you are infinite in this body. you are there before this birth for infinite time before 12.5 billion years around before as species were found and infinite ahead this age of 30 50 years is not your age you are born many time before so not to get so much disturbed by judgment of other beggars beggars are judging the beggars simply so one beggar is weeping another beggar is laughing one beggar putting shoulder up one beggar is all will go to the same dust one day so this is all the game like in the movie if some star suppose sharukh khan plays the role of a billionaire okay he plays the role of a billionaire so the other one other movie is playing the role of a beggar in some movie is playing role with the karishma as a wife in other he is playing role with the some madhuri dishit as a wife right you have seen it but at home gauri khan is sitting so he is not bothered at the stage wherever they are going for shooting they know this is all temporary all temporary so this is temporary nobody is permanent with you here You had been me many times the son or the daughter of many parents before this birth. You were husband or wife for many many before. This is not the first. Just play this role in the relaxed mode. This bungalow, car, all your money, your chair, everything will be snatched from you. Like if Shah Rukh plays the role of a prime minister in some movie, chair will be withdrawn. The movie is over. so nothing belongs to anyone here okay so better you understand the law of your being birth and the death and in between it is all of yours belongs to the one you were not before that also he was after you also everything will remain but you will not be there so better understand the theory of your being then question of this judgment your weakness will not come because if we all are sailing in the same death boat one day we are die, going to die temporary your bungalow if i get myself jealous of some bungalow temporary your chair if you are some officer or minister or whatever you are temporarily on the chair one day you are will be going to the same test i will be there so what is the use now Finally, if I let you know the result of your being, if you understand, not only that you will be feeling strong all the time, without getting yourself inferior, superior, superior with any judgment. Also, the biggest result of it will be, you will be liberated, salvated from this world. You will be enlightened, going out of this birth and death cycle, going back to the. God home, the Creator home, where all these godly people like Buddha, Mahavira, Jesus, Muhammad, Kabir, Parid, Ram, Parman, Sai Baba, Mira, Sai Jo, Lalla, Laujas, Sukrati is staying. You'll go back to that world of your permanent home. So that will be the result. And I hope little you must have understood now. If you want to go more into any subject in the school, college, you have gone for many years. So this subject of inner life, conscious. soul and the god theory of your being birth your today life and the death you will come to know once you continue with more spiritual lecture this is spirituality 
which will make you understand and will keep you beyond this all your feelings of getting weak judgment of others and you will feel all the time in bliss mode bliss let any thing come in front of you let any face tell you anything let abuse comes clapping comes slapping comes anything comes profit comes loss comes birth comes death comes you will not be anywhere shaked okay so continue with the spiritual lectures and you will feel more and more strong day by day okay